Hello students, a very good evening to all of you. I, Anupama, welcome you all at the Savil classes. I hope you all are doing fine. So, today we are start going to start lecture number 14 of the most important questions related to your exam. I am very, very fine. I am very fine students, very fine. चलिए तो स्टार्ट करते हैं हमारा आज का सेशन। Before we move on to the uh, question series, don't forget to like the video, subscribe the channel अगर आपने अभी तक नहीं किया है, and press the bell icon ताकि आपको important notifications मिलते रहें। Thank you so much। बच्चे rumors हैं, they are all rumors as of now. जदो तक कुछ डिपार्टमेंट वल्लो नहीं आ जांदा, उदो तक रूमर्स ही ने. I am very fine बच्चे, I am very very fine. चलिए तो स्टार्ट करते हैं हमारे आज के question series. Which of these is a historical novel by Amitav Ghosh? नहीं लगी बच्चे, कल सारे दे सारे open lectures of C. ठीक है? क्योंकि परसो, he had a party at the academy. Sahil sir ke bete ka first birthday tha. So, is wajah se kal sare open lectures of the. Yes. So, it is the glass palace. Very good. Question number two. Which of these writers is also political activist involved in human rights and environmental issues? Eki Ramanujan, Arundhati Roy, Anita Desai or Amitabh Ghosh. So, मुझे लगता है हो जाना चाहिए अगस्त के एंड तक या सितंबर के स्टार्टिंग पे हो जाना चाहिए यस इट वाज अरुंधति रॉय वेरी राइटली आंसर्ड क्वेश्चन नंबर 3 फॉर व्हिच बुक एके रामानुजन गॉट द साहित्य अकादमी अवार्ड एके रामानुजन को साहित्य अकादमी अवार्ड किस बुक के लिए मिला था द स्ट्राइडर्स द कलेक्टेड पोएम्स द ब्लैक हैंड और द सेकंड फाइट फाइट Yes, it is the collected poems. Very, very right. Question number four. Which of these writers also translated Virgil's works? Is me se kaun se writer ne Virgil ke works translate kare thi? John Milton, John Donne, John Dryden ya Ben Jonson. Which of these writers translated the works written by Virgil? Yes. Absolutely right. It was John Dryden. Very right. जिन्होंने John Dryden answer दिया है, उनका answer बिल्कुल correct है. Question number five. Which is the shortest book in Paradise Lost out of the twelve books? Six, ten, five or seven? Shortest book in Paradise Lost. बच्चे आज थोड़ी सी जल्दी में चलेगा हमारा जो lecture है, तो जल्दी जल्दी answers करते जाइएगा please. क्योंकि अगला लेक्चर जो है वो बहुत जल्दी स्टार्ट होना है तो हमारे पास लिमिटेड टाइम है यस तो द सेवेंथ बुक इज द शॉर्टेस्ट बुक क्वेश्चन नंबर 6 हु सेस द फॉलोइंग इन जूलियस सीजर देयर इज अ टाइड इन द अफेयर्स ऑफ मैन व्हिच टेकन एट द फ्लड्स ऑन लीड्स ऑन टू फॉर्च्यून एंटनी कैशियस ब्रूटस या जूलियस सीजर हां जी कौन कहता है ये देयर इज अ टाइड इन द अफेयर्स ऑफ मैन which taken at the floods on leads on to the fortune. Is it said by Antony? Is it said by Cassius, Brutus, or Julius Caesar? Yes, there is a tide in the affairs of men. So, this coat is made by Brutus. Yes. It is said by Brutus. Okay. The opportunities jo hai, wo ek tide ki tarah hamari taraf aati hai. Ek flood ki tarah hamari taraf aati hai. Okay. Kai baar, hamesha nahi, kai baar opportunities, ek saath kai opportunities aati hai. Hame select karna hai, कि हम हमारी डेस्टिनी हमें सही तरफ कौन सा आ, कौन सी अपॉर्चुनिटी लेके जाएगी ठीक है क्वेश्चन नंबर 7 
which society or people is closest to the platonic ideal governed by reason honesty and community in gulliver's travels coenham lilliput defusco ya brobdeng nag haan ji which society or people is closest to the platonic title jo logic bhi karte hain ऑनेस्ट भी हैं और कम्युनिटी में रहते हैं गुलीवर्स ट्रेवल्स में कोयन हम्स लिलीपुट एफुस्कु और ब्रॉबडिंग नैग कौन से लोग होते हैं वो यस एब्सोल्युटली राइट दे आर Koyan Hums, yes, they are Koyan Hums. Koyan Hums ही तो थे बच्चे जो बहुत बिल्कुल perfect माने गए थे, क्या? जो reason भी कर सकते थे, community में भी रहते थे और honest भी थे. They were Koyan Hums. All right, they were Koyan Hums. Okay, moving on to the next question. During what time essay of dramatic poesy was written by John Dryden? Yes, essay of dramatic poesy कब लिखा था John Dryden ने? Sixteen eight sixty seven sixty six या sixty nine? Yes, it was written in sixty eight. Question number nine. Erwin Ehrenfels is the biographer of Erwin Erwin Ehrenfels ने किसकी biography लिखी थी? Alexander Pope. Edmund Spencer, Jonathan Swift, or John Dryden. Rama, I have no idea. Bache exam kab hoga? I have no idea. Yes, Erwin Aaron Fries. Okay, written. Yes, it was Jonathan Swift ki biography likhi thi. G Jonathan Swift ki. Question number ten: The first play of Marlowe to be performed on stage, Doctor Foster's Tambour Lane, Edward II, or the Jew of Malta? Anji. Marlowe ka kaun sa first play tha? Yes, yes. Written is 1667. Right, Rahul. Right. Yes. So the first play to be performed on stage was Tambour Lane. Very right. Question number eleven. Who teamed with Joseph Edison to form the famous literary partnership that put out the news sheet, the Tatler, and the Daily Spectator? Yes, yes, Rahul is right. It was 1667. Samuel Richardson, John Barrington, Albert Samuels, or Richard Steele. So, its ka sabse easy hai ye question. Joseph Edison partnered with Richard Steele, right? Question number twelve. Which out of these terms was coined by Erasmus? कौन सी term Erasmus ने coin करी थी? Poetry, satire, poem master या poet taster? Which of these terms was coined by Erasmus? So again, this is a very very easy question. I hope for all of you, this is a very easy one. So that term was poet taster. ठीक है? Which is a play by Ben Jonson, right? Which is a play by Ben Jonson, a comedy by Ben Jonson. ने उसने दो writers के ऊपर attack किया था Marston और Decker पे, है ना Marston और Decker पे. चलिए. Question number thirteen. In whose manner Fielding wrote the novel Joseph Andrews? Cervantes, Don Quixote, Daniel Defoe's Moll Flanders, Mark Twain's The Adventures of Huckleberry Finn. Thomas Nashes, the unfortunate traveller. He say inspired who? Okay, feeling ne Joseph Andrews likha tha. Yes, Cervantes ke Don ko exhort se. So ki ek Picaros novel tha. Okay, which was also a Picaros novel. Question number fourteen. Ozymandias is the Greek name for which Egyptian pharaoh? Amenhotep, Neriker, Ramses II, ya Tutankhamun. Yes, Ozymandias is the Greek name for very right. It's the Greek name for Ramses too. Very good. Question number fifteen. Whose biography was written by John G. Lockhart? 
who wrote the biography of John G. Lockhart, Walter Scott, Jane Austen, Mary Shelley, or John Keats? Yes, John G. Lockhart has written the biography of Walter Scott. Absolutely right. Question number sixteen: Which of these writers is not attacked by Byron in English bards and Scottish reviewers? In which the con se writer ko attack nahi kiya hai Byron ne? English bards or Scottish reviewers me William Wordsworth, John Keats, Coleridge, or Francis Jeffrey. Yes, which of these is not criticized? Yes, it is John Keats. Very rightly answered. John Keats ko criticize nahi kiya hai. Question number seventeen. La Belle Dame Sans Merci is a dash written by John Keats. It's a ballad. It's a lyric. It's an ode or a sonnet. What is the yarner of La Belle Dame Sans Merci? Very right. It is a ballad. Very good. Question number eighteen. So free WhatsApp group. Hamara jaldi se join kariye jinhone nahi join kiya. अपना नाम और अपना मास्टर केडर का सब्जेक्ट लिख के भेज दीजिए इस नंबर पे और बच्चे जो आपको अभी तक पीडीएफ फाइल्स नहीं मिली है वो आपको एक आधे दिन में मिल जाएंगी ठीक है एक आधे दिन में मिल जाएंगी क्योंकि पीटेट के ग्रुप्स रिसेंटली स्टार्ट हुए हैं तो ज्यादातर जो स्टाफ है वो उसके साथ बिजी चल रहा था तो यू विल बी गेटिंग दीज पी डी एफ इन वन और टू डे ओके क्वेश्चन नंबर एटीन To whom vindications of the rights of women is dedicated by Mary Wollstonecraft? Vindications of the right of women is ko dedicate kara hai. M. Talleyrand, Perigord, Thomas Paine, William Godwin, ya Edmund Burke. Yes, it is dedicated to M. Talleyrand, Perigord. Bilkul sahi. Mary Shelley ne, Mary Wollstonecraft ne vindications of the right of women dedicate kia hai. M. Talleyrand, Perry, God, go. Okay, let's move on to the next question. The book Munera Pulveris, Hanji. The book Munera Pulveris by Ruskin is divided into six chapters, five chapters, seven chapters, or four chapters. How many chapters are there in this book Munera Pulveris? हाँ जी रिस्पॉन्स किया था बर्क को बिल्कुल सही रिस्पॉन्स किया था बर्क को यस देर आर टोटल सिक्स चैप्टर्स वेरी राइट क्वेश्चन नंबर ट्वेंटी अपार्ट फ्रॉम इन मेमोरियम विच अदर शॉर्ट एलिजी डिड टेनिस राइट ऑन द डेथ ऑफ हेलम हाँ जी इन मेमोरियम के अलावा और कौन सी एलिजी लिखी थी टेनिसन ने हेलम की डेथ पे ब्रेक 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 क्रॉसिंग द बार स्वीट एंड लो या नन ऑफ दीज हा मनप्रीत याद आ गया ठीक है जी इंडिकेशन ऑफ द राइट ऑफ मैन एडमंड बर्क को रिस्पॉन्ड करते हुए लिखा था यस इट इज ब्रेक 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 क्वेश्चन नंबर ट्वेंटी वन बेल्स एंड फॉर्मेग्रेनेट्स बाय रॉबर्ट ब्राउनिंग आर ऑल्सो नोन एज लाइफ एंड आर्ट poetry and thought narration and listening or all of the above kaise explain karte hain bells and pomegranates which is which is eighth volume work by robert browning yes it is all of these you know kitni sari poems hain kitne sare plays hain किसी में लाइफ की बात करी है किसी में आर्ट की बात करी है पोइट्री है थॉट्स है नरेशन भी है और लिसनिंग भी है सो इट हैज एवरीथिंग इट हैज एवरीथिंग इन ऑल दीज एट वॉल्यूम्स ऑल राइट मूविंग ऑन टू द नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन व्हाट टाइप ऑफ लाइफ इज पोर्ट्रेड इन द नॉवल क्रैंक कोड बाय अलिजाबेथ गास्कल सैड एंड मिजरेबल फनी एंड डिलाइटफुल rich and wealthy young none of these hanji what type of life is portrayed in the novel cranford by elizabeth gaskell yes absolutely right it is sad and miserable bachche oh bhi karwaange ik var a wale tak khatam kar lo ik var a wale tak khatam kar lo b 25 lecture mein aidan lagane ne ke fir us to baad age wise lagawange 
ਤੇ ਏਜ ਵਾਈਜ਼ ਤਾਂ ਬਹੁਤ ਵਾਰ ਕਰ ਚੁੱਕੇ ਆਪਾਂ ਰਮਾ ਏਜ ਵਾਈਜ਼ ਤਾਂ ਬਹੁਤ ਵਾਰ ਕਰ ਚੁੱਕੇ ਠੀਕ ਹੈ ਕੁਐਸਚਨ ਨੰਬਰ 23 ਹੂਸ ਡੈਥ ਇਜ਼ ਮੋਨਡ ਬਾਈ ਆਨਲਡ ਇਨ ਹਿਸ ਮੈਮੋਰੀਅਲ ਵਰਸਸ ਆਇਰਨ ਸ਼ੈਲੀ ਕੀਟਸ ਵਰਜ਼ਵਰ ਗੋਥ ਬਾਇਰਨ ਕੀਟਸ ਕੋਲਰੇਜ ਬਾਇਰਨ ਜਾਂ ਸ਼ੈਲੀ ਬਾਇਰਨ ਸਪੈਂਸਰ ਹਾਂਜੀ ਕੋਈ ਸੀਨ ਨਹੀਂ ਹਲੇ ਏਕਤਾ ਆਈ ਡੋਨਟ ਨੋ ਐਨੀਥਿੰਗ ਅਬਾਊਟ ਦਾ ਐਗਜ਼ਾਮ ਉਹੀ ਤਾਂ ਮੈਂ ਕਹਿ ਰਹੀ ਆ ਬੱਚੇ ਉਹੀ ਤਾਂ ਮੈਂ ਕਹਿ ਰਹੀ ਕਿ ਏਜ ਵਾਈਜ਼ ਤਾਂ ਬਹੁਤ ਸਾਰੇ ਲੈਕਚਰਸ ਮਿਲ ਜਾਣਗੇ ਤੁਹਾਨੂੰ ਸਾਡੇ ਚੈਨਲ ਤੇ ਯੈਸ ਇਟ ਇਜ਼ ਵਰਜ਼ਵਰਥ ਗੋਥ ਐਂਡ ਬਾਇਰਨ ਵੈਰੀ ਰਾਈਟ ਵਰਜ਼ਵਰਥ ਗੋਥ ਐਂਡ ਬਾਇਰਨ ਕੁਐਸਚਨ ਨੰਬਰ 24 what type of critic walter pater was aesthetic moral political ya social han ji what type of a critic walter pater was yes he was an aesthetic critic theek hai art for art sake theek hai art for art sake ko aestheticism hi kaha jata hai right question number 25 in which novel by charlotte bronte the character blockel hurst appears charlie professor jane ayer or willet in which novel by charlotte bronte do you find the character blockel hurst yes so he is the character in jane ayer who is the principal at lowood school ke okay, lowood school mein principal hota hai question number 26 Which of these does not make a part of Dickens' A Tale of Two Cities? So, Tale of Two Cities is divided in three parts. In me se konsa odd one out hai? We call to life, the golden thread, track of storm or the golden gate. Yes, which is the odd one out? Yes, it is the golden gate. Absolutely correct. Question number 27. with which thing event the modern writers felt betrayed han ji kis cheez se jo hai the modern writers felt the most betrayed industrialization modernization world war or rise of middle class so yes you all are well aware of that it is world war very very right question number 28 under the influence of reading which writer did ts eliot create the second phase of his poetry han ji second phase of poetry ts eliot ka kis writer se jo hai influence tha alarum the ford chaucer ya spencer bilkul kirat even i agree with this ki edda zyada acha revision ho raha hai yes it was le ford very good question number 29 hogart press set up by the wolves did not publish which of these authors ts eliot sigmund freud charles darwin or dostoevsky han ji hogarth press kis writer ke works publish nahi karti thi yes it was charles darwin very very good question number 30 for which of her work did virginia wolf take references from the shakespearean play as you like it as you like it ke se references virginia wolf ne apne kis novel ke liye liye the the voyage out to the lighthouse night and day ya jacob's room han ji for which of his work did virginia wolf take references yes it was night and day very good it was night and day question number 31 according to what ts eliot mentioned in the possibility of poetic drama dash is among several forms of poetry novel prose ode or drama han ji according to what ts eliot mentioned in his essay the possibility of poetic drama dash is among several forms of poetry so that is yes that is drama right dekho title mein hi aa gaya poetic drama title mein hi aa gaya bacche yes so the answer is drama 
ऐसे क्वेश्चंस में कॉमन सेंस यूज करनी है आंसर कंफर्म नहीं है तो तुक्का नहीं लगाना है ठीक है तुक्का नहीं लगाना है थोड़ी सी रीजनिंग करनी है कुछ क्वेश्चंस में ये थोड़ी सी क्वेश्चन रीजनिंग करनी है लॉजिक लगाना है लुक एट द टाइटल लुक एट द टाइटल द टाइटल इट सेल्फ इज गिविंग यू दी आंसर तो देर इज नो डाउट अबाउट इट क्वेश्चन नंबर थर्टी टू ऑल राइट विच ऑफ द नॉवल बाई कॉन्ड इज सेट इन रशिया नॉस्ट्रोमो अंडर वेस्टर्न आई एलमियर्स फॉली और लॉर्ड जिम हाँ जी विच ऑफ द नॉवल बाय कॉन्ड इज सेट इन रशिया येस इट इज अंडर वेस्टर्न आई विच इज अय नॉवल विच इज अ डिटेक्टिव नॉवल बाय जोजफ कॉन्ड्रेड क्वेश्चन नंबर थर्टी थ्री Which essay of James Joyce did his college magazine refuse to print? Essay on stream of consciousness technique, essay on Irish literature, on British literature, or modern literature? हाँ जी, James Joyce का कौन सा essay उनकी college magazine ने print करने से मना कर दिया था? Yes, it was essay on Irish literature. Very good, very right the answer. Question number thirty four. Which novel of Edward Morgan Foster was published in 1924? E.M. Foster का कौन सा नॉवल 1924 में पब्लिश हुआ था? A Passage to India, Howard's End, A Room with a View, or The Longest Journey? So yes, it was A Passage to India. Very good. Question number 35. Who is the writer of short stories Carlyle's House and other sketches? Virginia Woolf, James Joyce, E. M. Foster, or D. H. Lawrence? Yes. Who is the writer of short stories Carlyle's House and Other Sketches? Yes. Very good. It is Virginia Woolf. Very right. It is Virginia Woolf. Question number thirty-six. What is the yarner of Mosada published by W. B. Yeats? Anji. Mosada published by W. B. Yeats. Ka apko yarner batana hai. It's an ode, a dramatic poem, or a pamphlet. What is the yarner of Mosada? Yes, it is a dramatic poem and a pamphlet. Very right. It's both B and C. Very very good. Question number thirty-seven. Which was the first successful play of G. B. Shaw? Pygmalion, The Widower's House. The Philanderers or Arms and the Man, Anji. Which was the first successful play of G. B. Shaw? Yes, it was Arms and the Man. Very very good. It was Arms and the Man. Question number thirty seven. Which of these writers was not referred to face tradition by Lewis in his essay The Great Tradition? Jane Austen. George Eliot, Charles Dickens, or Joseph Conrad? Hanji. Kis writer ke baare mein baat nahi kari Lewis ne apne great tradition mein, jabki wo bada acha novelist hai. Yes, it was Charles Dickens. Aur fir apni galti ko sahi karte huye, fir apni galti ko sahi karte huye jo hai, usne jo hai sirf Dickens ke baare mein. अलग से स्टोरी लिखी वर्क लिखा ठीक है फिर उसने डिकेंस के बारे में फिर अलग से जो है वर्क लिखा क्वेश्चन नंबर थर्टी नाइन हु इज द राइटर ऑफ एसेज ऑन शेक्सपियर एसेज ऑन शेक्सपियर के राइटर कौन है एफ आर लीवीज आई ए रिचर्ड विलियम एम्सन और जी बी शॉ हु इज द राइटर ऑफ एसेज ऑन शेक्सपियर Is it F. R. Lewis, William Empson, T. B. Shaw, 
और आई ए रिचर्ड्स यस एब्सोल्युटली राइट इट इज विलियम एम्सन वी हैव डन इट बिफोर हमने पहले भी करा हुआ है ना वेरी गुड एक था यू रिमेंबर द डेट एज वेल वाह भाई वाह क्वेश्चन नंबर 40 इन व्हिच ईयर डिड आई ए रिचर्ड्स प्रैक्टिकल क्रिटिसिज्म गॉट पब्लिश्ड 1922 ट्वेंटी थ्री ट्वेंटी नाइनटीन ट्वेंटी फोर या नाइनटीन ट्वेंटी फाइव हाँ जी आई रिचर्ड का प्रैक्टिकलिज्म आई आई ए Richards. Yes, it was published in 1929. So yes, the options are right. Very good. Jinko, ऐसे ही डेट याद थी. बहुत बढ़िया. Question number 41. How many poems are there in Larkin's The Less Deceived? हाँ जी. हाँ, मैं confused हो जाती हूँ. Principles of Criticism. Right, right. Principles of Criticism was in 1924. And this was in 1929. Okay, how many poems are there in Larkin's The Less Deceived? 27, 28, 29, or 26. So yes, there are total 29 poems. Very good. Question number 42. In which novel of Stevy Smith you find the character of Celia, who works for the Ministry of Cryptography? The Holiday. Novel on the yellow paper, over the frontier, tender only to one. हाँ जी, Stevie Smith के कौन से novel में you find this character Celia who is a cryptographer. Are you sure? I'm getting two answers. Holiday and over the frontier both. Yes, it is holiday. Right, it is holiday. Question number forty-three. What is the film version of Graham Greene, The Man Within? Man Within, वे कौन सी फिल्म बनी थी? The Smugglers in the Country, The Smugglers, The Smugglers of the United States, या The Criminals. Yes. फिल्म कौन सी फिल्म बनी थी Graham Greene के नोवेल The Man Within पे? Yes, it was the smugglers only, right? Question number forty-four. Which of these is a science fiction by Salman Rushdie? Dreamers, Midnight's Children, Shame, or the Satanic Verses? Hanji. Which of these is a science fiction by Salman Rushdie? Yes, it is Dreamers. Very good. And the last question for today. To whom did B. S. Naipaul dedicate his short story collection, A Flag on the Island? Hanji, B. S. Naipaul ne apni short story collection, A Flag on the Island, kisko dedicate kari thi? B. S. Naipaul ko khud ko, Graham Greene ko, Dinah Ethel ko, ya Harold Pinter ko? Yes, absolutely right. It was Dinah Ethel. So very very well done, all of you. So. Thank you so much, everyone, for attending the lecture. Tomorrow again, we will meet at the same time with some new questions. So keep preparing like this, keep revising like this. Thank you so much. Have a very good day. Keep learning and keep taking care of yourselves. Thank you so much, everyone. Have a very good day.